Hey, Grim, is it true ducks fly upside down here because there's nothing worth crapping on? Moving on. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Grim Bay attackers battle the Leveland Burns. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yeah, it's a beautiful day for MFL football. At least in the booth with the AC, personal servants, and blood shield. Hi, Grim Blitzer here with you, along with my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. How are you guys doing? Well, I'm doing that little hottie who works in deep fry at the concessions. He said, "How, not who, you idiot." Even if you got the answer right. And it's first and ten. Looks like the defense called the ginormous dirty trick. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. That's about a three-yard pickup. Third down and three. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his... Re and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And that'll bring up second and one. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving a point. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. Punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. He's not just burning down the house, he's taking it to the house. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to made it the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. That's a killer. 
it was right there and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy. Second down and ten. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. First down and three. Oh, man, I love this dirty kid. He just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. First down and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. He had it for a second there. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he rumbles for big yardage on that play. They're back in business, Bricks. My mom told me to stay out of other people's businesses, Grim. Third down and, well, good luck. <laughs> Only exploding baby diapers, Batman. That just knocked the ball loose. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. And it's first and ten. Some good old fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. Caught for the first down. First down and one. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Defensive play that was, Bricks. Can 
Grant by Grant Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grant. You're right. And it's first and ten. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. Quarter one comes to an end. If they don't get it together, this game is going to turn into a rout. And it's first and ten. Yo, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? Third down and eight. Set of downs. And it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. First down and five. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. Second and eight to go. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third and four. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. <laughs> Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. And this guy is on Fuego. Does he like his original or extra crispy? <laughs> By the looks of it, extra crispy. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And 
and it's first and ten. And he's on the one feet dirty break, and he breaks away. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sick. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. further than that, but she doesn't have to play against goddamn monsters. And that'll be second and eight to go. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's two minutes left in the half. I can't wait to the halftime show. And it's first and ten. This is your brain. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The 20. The 10. Holy mother of mutant mayhem, he scores! And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive. Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And that'll be second and eight to go. ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of... Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And that'll be their final timeout. out. 
You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he got an off. That's a decent punt. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snags. He got hit by a car and died. Oh, it's a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I gotta. Uh, <clears throat> hey, you gotta go. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and a timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points and let's move on. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half and a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. What a game is this as the score indicates. <laughs> they need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. You've got to catch that. Third down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. Catch the ball. Get the first down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Hot. Second down and more than the QB would like. so hard I went into a dark tunnel thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light turns out it was just the visitors tunnel that he knocked me into and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face 
Well, surprise me. He made it look easy and he gets three points for it. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. That's a pass and catch for a no game. Then how is it a pass? Second down and ten. You can tell he's a berserker because he's from the game. Second night to that guy, Bricks. Ah, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Warming up. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. And out comes the most underrated position in football the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. And it's off. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And the quarterback calls a sonic blast dirty trick and throws a supersonic missile to his... That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten.
You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch. And he oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. And the passing game picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Oh, what a brutal hit! Second and three. Hot, hot one. Up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Eight. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. Second down and ten. That's a nice catch for five yards with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. Third down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! You are dirt and some fun on your time! Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. <laughs> 
He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. Second down and 10. Oh, I love this. Man, this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about one of those video game fire balls. I mean, literally, he's like burning. And he fumbles at Bricks. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. He could go all the way. He's at the 10. He scores! I feel like I've been here before. Is this deja vu? This is like our Brazilian season, dumbass. Actually, I think he's talking about the time warp dirty trick that the defense just played. Still a dumbass, though. He like every one of my barbecues. This guy's on fire. Does he like original or extra crispy? It looks like extra crispy. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a lick and it keeps it. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. Oh, and he just turned ginormous. Look out! Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. And that'll bring us to the two-minute warning. It's do or die now. Third and two. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. The defense calls timeout. They must be trying to get on their QB's good side. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running bonfire. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 40. The 30. He's at first down. He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy low hands nose. It's a mare in lost wages, Nevada. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. Uh. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a position. Stealing ain't right, Glenn. It just ain't right. And it's first and ten. And 
And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least some... No more timeouts for the defense! Or the offense, Bricks. That's, that's the important part. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive. Well, if you're into humiliation and scatological fetishes, this Burns loss was right up your alley. Well, that's a waste of an afternoon if you're a Leland fan. But if you're from Leland, uh, that's what everything feels like. I suppose so. After you. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. God, that was beautiful. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Brim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every other...